Well, this is awkward. After failing to excite on the Xbox Live Arcade, Lucha Fury by Punch's Impact promptly disappeared from the gaming consciousness. And now, a little over six months later, Chilingo and Candybox Studios have snuck the game onto the App Store, under the rather generic name of Street Wrestler. Unfortunately, despite taking the time to spruce up certain aspects of the game, much of what made the original so unpalatable as a side-scrolling beat-em-up has survived the trip, making it a hard game to enjoy. Before we dive into what doesn't work, let's highlight what does. The artistic style. The execution of Street Wrestler's fantastically colourful Lucha Libre inspired world is spot on, with everything from simple henchmen to machines sporting masks and exuding vibrant energy. However, what's far less exciting is the combat and controls, two aspects that are paramount for the success of any beat-em-up. Everything from movement to attacking, jumping and pulling off various basic manoeuvres is offset by a frustrating delay that, while manageable, makes the game feel sluggish even when using the speediest of the available characters. This also affects the game's all-purpose button, used for grabbing items, people or performing slides and jumps off platforms, meaning it's all too easy to find yourself sliding instead of following up on a knockdown, or, worst of all, sliding in the wrong direction as your character is still considered to be turning around mid-animation. One extremely odd decision on the part of the developer was the separation of the characters and the progress made throughout the game. Clearing a stage with one character doesn't do so for another, artificially bulking up the content and preventing players from experimenting with alternative characters, should they fail a particular level. On the bright side, the shortened stages have been redesigned for the iOS release, meaning you won't suffer too badly should you want to retry the level again later. Lastly, by now it's bordering on a cardinal sin to allow action to occur underneath the player's thumb, and sadly given the nature of most fights, you do just that, thanks to the sprawling button layout and sluggish movement controls. Street Wrestler is ultimately a textbook case of style over substance. The world, its visual appeal and concept are top notch, but when paired with its sluggish and monotonous gameplay, you can't help but feel as though all that effort has been thrown out the window. This has been Andrew with AppSpy.com. We review, you decide.